And good morning to you, Grand Jury of the Seas. Want to talk a little bit about the why in changing the itinerary. And it was all about getting you into better weather, knowing the conditions we were heading into. This trends in the models for this potential storm have actually gone down into a weaker system. In fact, the low actually over Nicaragua this morning as I'm making this video. And it looks to just kind of bobble and wander and it will bring a lot of rain. That is not the only thing that is playing into this. Part of our decision is this storm here on the Pacific side of Guatemala here is actually pulling that moisture and swell across. And Costa Maya is wide open. There is no uh, protection from the port, any natural barriers. It is straight from the east, so any swell, we're gonna end up scratching. And that's what we're seeing is first and foremost, the swell looks like it's gonna be too high and too problematic. And then this, the dust, Saharan dust layer, how does that play into this? It also is keeping all the tropical activity pushed to the south. So it's just feeding all the rain and moisture right on top of the Western Caribbean peninsula starting on Saturday, both Saturday and Sunday looking really messy and ugly. That's why we're taking Cozumel tomorrow on Friday, and then we'll have the two sea days. We're coming back up into the Gulf where you'll be in the sunshine and in high pressure, and knowing that we would have had that scratch anyway from Costa Maya. So it was all just about just kind of reworking it. If we knew things were not going to be a pleasant experience and making sure if we're going to mess with the itinerary, that we got you the best weather as possible. So again, I hope uh, you are enjoying it so far. Enjoy Cozumel tomorrow. Captain Perrier and his entire bridge team have got you in great hands. And I'll see you with another tropical briefing through the day online on my social media handle. It's at James Van Fleet on Twitter. Take care, friends.